Hello friends, I'm Shiny and I welcome you to the Bread of Life. Let us look to the Holy Bible. Matthew chapter 27 verse 57 to 66. The main idea of the day is lead Jesus in a new tomb. When it was evening, there came a rich man from Arimathea named Joseph, who also was a disciple of Jesus. He went to Pilate and asked for the body of Jesus. Then Pilate ordered it to be given to him. And Joseph took the body and wrapped it in a clean linen shroud and laid it in his own new tomb, which he had cut in the rock. And he rolled a great stone to the entrance of the tomb and went away. The next day, that is, after the day of preparation, the chief priests and the Pharisees gathered before Pilate and said, Sir, we remember how that imposter said, while he was still alive. After three days, I will rise. Therefore, order the tomb to be made secure until the third day, lest his disciple go and steal him away and tell the people he has risen from the dead. And the last fraud will be worse than the first. Pilate said to them, You have a guard of soldiers. Go make it as secure as you can. Let us understand. Joseph of Arimathea went to Pilate and asked for the body of Jesus after he died on the cross. The disciples all ran away when Jesus was captured, but Joseph revealed he was a disciple of Jesus through his actions. Joseph did not care about what other people thought, and he did his best to properly bury Jesus. He wrapped the body of Jesus in clean linens and laid it in his own new tomb. Do you lack courage to say you believe in Jesus? Or do you worry about what others might think of your faith? Let us be brave and courageous like Joseph and reveal that we truly love Jesus. May the Lord bless us with these beautiful words. Let us pray and practice. Dear God, thank you for your beautiful words. Lord, please help us to be brave and courageous in every situation. In Jesus' name I ask this prayer. Amen.